Hey guys, welcome to Day Zero's D Pad here on Krypton Radio and YouTube. You're still lazy. <laughs> <laughs> um, we're your hosts, Kirby Kid and Jen, and today we're talking about well, what's going on in All Stars because uh, it warrants another uh, podcast. Mm-hmm. I think we're gonna have this for quite some time I think now. So, I mean, we we have the the patch that came out that made it a little harder for Sackboy. Mm-hmm. And yeah. also the DLC. Yeah, he needs more. Uh, he needs more AP now. To get his specials off. Yeah. Not just his specials, just in general. Like, all his... Most of his attacks were, you know, nerfed down. No, they're still the same. It's just the specials that they... That's just the specials that they changed. No, no. Like, the, the, uh, the attacks, specifically, like, they... Like, they need more AP. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, but, like, his regular normal attacks are still... Oh, Still okay. annoying as crap. Like, that, sure. gr- like that grab that he <laughs> just... He's like, you know what? No. No ultimate for you. I'm grabbing you. <laughs> No, but uh, so his AP is a little slower now, which is great. Uh, Dante's uh, neutral triangle Mm -hmm. has been changed. Yep, so you won't be able to spam it as much. Yes, and uh, now, on to the good news. We do have some DLC coming. Yep. We have a couple of new maps. We have one from Wipeout and one from Heavenly Sword, which is where Nariko's from. I seriously thought it was Heavenly Sword combined with Wipeout. No, it's uh, it's two separate maps. Two separate things. Two separate maps, okay, yeah. sure. Let's. I go mean, with that. I mean, they all can eventually like kind of cross over anyway. But I think I think it's two separate maps, and uh, Nariko's is a uh, kind of like a final destination kind of where it's just flat. Good. We need one. Yeah, it's an arena. It's an arena kind. Uh, Wipeout. Well, well you know, it's more it's, like F Zero. It's, it's F Zero from from Smash. It's kind of like that except uh, Wipeout things are bigger. <laughs> mm-hmm. So uh, that's what's coming that way. But also, we have two new characters. That's what I'm most excited about. Okay, well, what are the two characters? We have the main character from Starhawk, Starhawk, the one that came out in the summer, which is pretty fun. Mm-hmm. And uh, we have the main character from Gravity Rush, which is a PSN game. Oh, uh, these are two fairly new games, and I'm surprised they made it in. Uh, but it's, it's th- cool to see that they got recognized. Yeah, I think they only made it in because of the fact that it's like, hey, we need some more characters in here. Yeah, let's let's add some more. Let's just add a whole. You know, Plus, the, the main character of Starhawk is the uh, only black guy. So, woohoo, black guy! All right, made it in. We made it in, guys. We All are right. moving on up. Yeah, just one. One day we'll be president. Oh, up. <laughs> up. Uh, uh, <laughs> but yeah, so looking forward to that. I think as long as they keep releasing these characters. Oh, by the way, they're free. The oh first yes. First two weeks. So even if you don't have the game. Go on PSN, download those characters, because you, you can, may get the game one day. Exactly. You never know. And even though you're you may be with it or against it, just just get the, get you, the, the DLC. Get Come it. on. It's it's free. It's free. And if they keep going like this, I can see this being the new brawler type of game. Like it's definitely I think Evo uh, worthy because one, they listen, they listen they listen to the cat uh, to the, the people in the community, they they actually make changes. They make they have patches they're adding characters, so hopefully they'll add at least a whole other like string. You know, right yeah. now we have we have two levels. I would love they added a whole other level, mm-hmm. like eventually. Um, I think this has a lot of good potential. I mean, people are yeah. getting stupid hacks at this game already. Mm-hmm. It's uh, ridiculous. We've it, seen people who are at already level nine nine nine. Yeah, you'll hopefully see some of those videos on our YouTube channel of us getting baby shaken. <laughs> we really don't have a lot of time to play. We play mainly on our recording days, yeah, uh, which may have to change because I'm tired of getting stomped on. I don't know about you, but no, I'm getting tired of it too. Yeah, so we may have to just spend a couple of days just practicing. Um, <laughs> but uh, I'm looking forward to this game, like getting bigger, you know, evolving more. Because I mean, it's been out for not even a month yet, a full month, and they're already evolving it. Yep. I mean, this is really cool. Um, I'm, ho- I'm still want Spyro in there, which they said they're not gonna put him in there. But you know, hey, wishful thinking, wishful yeah, thinking. Yeah, I want Crash, Crash Bandicoot. Oh, deserves yes. Chance. And honestly, I kind of want some Final Fantasy characters to be in there. Some Tifa. Tifa. Yeah, and, that's uh, about it. Or maybe you know from uh, FF10. <laughs> oh, that'd be great. Or no, FF10 too. Yeah. She's wearing not as many clothes. Oh come on! You know how you know how games are, and well, games are with girls. Yeah. The less you have... The stronger you are. How is that possible? Because that's just how the world should work. <laughs> how the world should work. Uh, but yeah, I'm looking forward to those uh, new characters coming in, hopefully new other characters, and yeah. we're going to keep you guys updated. Like, every time something new happens, you know, we're just going to talk about it and rave about it, and hopefully it won't suck. 
But right now, like, cause, like Sony has had such a bad track record these last couple of years, I'm, I'm really glad that for once something good is happening for Sony. Mm-hmm. Slowly and surely they'll go back up. I mean, if you saw their stocks, just this is from a business standpoint, mm-hmm. their stocks have been gradually going down. I, yeah. I noticed it. Well, then now is the time to buy. Yeah, this is the time to buy. It's like what six? It from what I last saw, it was like six twenty-five for. For a Sony stock? Yeah. Wait, six dollars? Six dollars, twenty-five cents. Oh, I'm gonna go buy me like a million stocks. Yeah, yeah, you go do that. Yeah, like, that's crazy. <laughs> you can play the stock market, but remember, it, it's Sony, so right now it's gradually going down. This is the time to buy. Yeah, because but... like, well, you know, we we have Microsoft announcing the uh, Xbox 720. Yeah. Which you know, PS4 is not far behind. Mm-hmm. Now, if they're smart, which you know, is debatable. Uh, <laughs> They'll launch PS4 and not have it be $600 like they launched PS3. Yeah. That's why a lot of people didn't have it. I mean, that's why I didn't have it. I had Xbox. And oh. I, was a, I was a huge PS hater. And then Storm came and that changed it. So. And you're like, ah, oh, maybe I should get a PS3. I was like, well, then I have to get, I have to get that now. That, that's, just, that's what's happening. Mm-hmm. But uh, if, they, they, if they launch it, they're going to have to launch it at like $400 max. Max, because, yeah. Because like, let, let, the Wii U launched at $400 and... I mean, it, it sold out, you know, it's doing pretty good, but it's going to be another Wii, where it sells no, it's pretty not quickly, just, you will... and then it's going to just fade off. I mean, yeah. a lot of people don't see it being worth that much money. That's the problem. And they already saw from the Wii that they're going to buy it, be hyped about it for about a year, and then it's going to be sitting, sitting there collecting dust. Again. Because, I mean, people say, well, no, it's, no, 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 but it, they've already proven one time that that's happened. <laughs> at this point in time, you know, yes. It's not, like, so, basically, it's on them to prove it's wrong. Yeah. yeah. But the cool thing is that, well, okay, if you read my article about the, the Wii U, it has HD capabilities. Mm, wow, little, welcome to four years ago. <laughs> they're a little late on that, but at least they have HD capabilities now. They have achieved first generation Xbox Oh, my God. <laughs> I mean, like, I played it. It's confusing. I have a friend who I will not name, uh, who works at Nintendo, who was given a Wii U for free and said it sucks. Uh, That's pretty (laughs) bad. That's pretty bad. There's too much going on. The games don't... The games really don't warrant buying another console because all the big name games but it's on not Wii U a, are also on Xbox and PS3. But see, it's not a console. It's not another, not necessarily another console, but more no. like an accessory to the Wii. Already. No, 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 no. no. It, it's the whole, the whole. It's the whole. It's the the console and the controller. Oh, is it? Yeah, it's the whole thing. Oh, okay. It, yeah, it's yeah. Well, um, anyway. But you know, it, you the, the, like the big games are already on the other consoles. Like, for example, with Assassin's Creed 3, the only advantage you get playing the Wii U is that a mini-map appears on the controller. Which is kind of cool. But not really... You don't you don't use the mini-map that much in Creed 3. Oh. Well, then, never yeah. mind. And it's coming from someone who's beaten all the Creed games. Mm. You don't really... I mean, you use it to, like, like, oh, where am I going? Okay, quick look and you're done. It's not, like, that integral to the game, you know? Mm. So, I mean, they're going to have to step really it step it up. Like, what they need to do is they need to come up with a regular controller that doesn't have a screen. Make that available. Make it, like, the second-gen classic controller. Well, I mean, that's what they did before. Yeah, they need to do that, and then they need to have regular games. Because these gimmick games are fun for five minutes, and then the gimmick wears off. Yeah. Which is... And I said it years ago, and I was proven true when the Wii started sucking. But see, now they're actually integrating, like, third-party games. Well, right now it's just a launch. We gotta see true. if they're gonna maintain this. Yeah, that's true. But because what a third party player, uh, party uh, makers just decide to just cut stop. them off. Because right now, I know a lot of work is gonna, is gonna be going into Xbox Seven Twenty. Mm-hmm. That's where all that's where all the new money is because the Wii boom is over. Yeah. Like your first month and a half is when people are like, oh my god, this console. <laughs> and then after that, it kind of dies down. Yeah. That happens all the time, FYI. Because there, there, there won't be a boom around Christmas because anyone who was buying it for someone for Christmas bought it already. Yeah. And you're not getting any more stock for a while. So exactly. the boom is over for this year. Next year is all about the Xbox. If granted. Unless Sony decides to step in. Yes. Exactly. But Anyway, back to Sony and yeah, Sony All-Stars. Sony, we kind of, de- you know, Yeah, but speaking about the Wii, though, <laughs> their, the Sony All-Stars' biggest competitor is going to be Smash 4. Now... If yes. the Wii U actually does suck and doesn't bring in 
you know, actual gamers. Because there's actual gamers, there's actual gamers, and there's casual gamers. I'm sorry, casual gamers, you're not real gamers. <laughs> but um, if if it fails to bring in the hardcore gamers, I think Smash Four is going to lose just by virtue of no one playing it because no one wants a Wii U. Yeah, but some because I think the Wii depends. doesn't have the Wii U. I don't think has um, GameCube support, does it? Cause I know I know, the, I know the Wii Mini doesn't have it. No, it doesn't. So Wii U can't play GameCube games. No, but the Wii so, can. So basically, what you're saying is the no, new no, console see, is just un unattractive to. The entire Smash community. Well, it's not like you can't play it on the Wii U. You just can't play it on that screen controller. You can still use the, uh, you know, like a regular so, GameCube controller. So can the can the what well, does the Wii U console have a plug-in for a GameCube? From what I know, I'm not. To be honest, I'm not even too sure. Okay, well, we'll, we'll have to get back on that and, yeah. and figure it out. I'll ask my uh, my friend from Nintendo to see what he thinks. <laughs> but, uh, anyway. Yeah, it's biggest competitor is going to be Smash 4. Yeah. Because that's the only other game out there that does what this does. Exactly. And to be honest, you know, Smash... Uh, brawl. <laughs> uh, FYI, I'm not much of a Brawl fan. If you know. I don't understand, because I like Brawl. I don't like Brawl. Like, brawl, I thought was really no, fun. Like, no. they added new characters and crap, and no. Kirby was, was not as floaty. The... F- Everyone, was like, everyone yeah. was. The problem was that everyone was too floaty, and not that's Kirby. that's Her, the problem. Kirby was like, "Yes, I got it better." But see, that's the problem I have with Kirby. Sony All Stars. Some, well, some see, characters are really too floaty. They're they're not floaty. They just have double jumps and air combos. Like yeah. they have crazy air combos in this game. Yes, I know. So, be, like, so if you choose to do air combos, you're gonna be in the air for a while. I know. And see, from a Smash point of view, right now, at least from but my you can't point use view, Smash point of view on this game. I know. It's that, it's that'd hard. Be, that'd be like going. To uh, Goldeneye saying, you know what? This game plays nothing like Street Fighter. <laughs> I'm mad. No, Why can't I no. side dodge? Why can't I do it's more loops? It's more like Goldeneye and, and uh, Halo. Anyway, we should start wrapping this up, guys. Yeah, so I'm, I'm glad we, we all uh, we, we all agree that they're not floaty. Oh, they're... That, no, that, we have not that, even that, agreed not, on that. That not only ha- is this argument over... No, this Jane, argument is not over. That, that you Jane know what? has conceded. No, I have not conceded. And, Do you and all la- understand? And no, no there is no concession here. For, for, for to the fact winning. that we need to but still discuss until, this until further. Time, well, let's do this every Sunday on Computer Radio <laughs> at 5 p.m., where Jim will further concede. No, the point. I will not concede he to will anything. Find, he will find new ways to concede the point. <laughs> there is no such um, thing as concede. But in, here. In, in, until then, uh, we've been your hosts, uh, Kirby Kid. And Jim. Who was wrong. No, he is, and, I'm not wrong. <laughs> we'll see you guys later. <laughs> Don't forget to subscribe to us on uh, YouTube at Day Zero TV, which is at a zero instead of an actual O because we're clever. Uh, our <laughs> website at the same thing, DayZero.com. With an uh, actual zero. Like us, favorite us, find us on Facebook. Everything is just day zero. Uh-huh. Uh huh. And we'll see you guys check next us time. Out. And uh, we may be playing Far Cry because Six wants to play Far Cry. Oh. So, oh. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But uh, if you guys want us to play anything, uh, let us know. Let us know because we're gonna have we're gonna take a couple weeks off for Christmas because we have families. You know. Yeah. So <laughs> kind let, of important. Let us know what what you want us to play and cover and. We'll try and get that done during our break, and then we'll just let the episodes all out at the same time and let them fight amongst each other. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and we're going to be playing, we're going to be doing more, uh, you know, commentary video games. Uh, but until then, uh, we've been your hosts. See you guys later, and uh, have a good week until Far Cry.